All right, we'd like to take a look at the Cisco IP Phone 301, otherwise known as a SPA 301. Now, this phone is all about low cost. Uh, it has a MSRP of $79 and as few features as possible to get that price down there. But we'll look at the pros and we'll look at the cons. Well, number one, it does have the Cisco name on and it does look, you know, for a low cost phone, it does look as nice as a phone can look without a display and some other things. Um, another thing is it has a the nice, uh, nicely laid out web interface that you can log in to configure the phone. Uh, and it's fairly simple to do that. Um, the handset feel is feels good, nice and balanced, nice weight. Um, the audio sounds good on it from using it for a couple days. And uh, it also does, we'll take a look at what buttons it has here. It does have on the side, it does have a ringer. It's only on and off, no volume there. I uh, presume you could set that ringer volume on the web, but I didn't look. Um, it can be mounted, if you'll notice here, we have the little uh, item or the little notch that we can turn so we can make this either a wall mount or desk phone. It does set on the desk, nice and firm. Of course, we have the mounts in the back there. Um, as far as I know, it's probably one of the smallest width phones that you can get. You know, I can see what it is there. It's uh, a pretty, pretty narrow phone. Oh, what is it? Uh, to have all the little bezels and whatnot, four inches ish, 4.25. I think I measured it at. So, probably the narrowest sit phone that I know of. There's probably one some uh, in some corner that I don't know about, but as far as the, the major manufacturers. Uh, we will go over a couple things here. There is only, while these buttons here look like they probably are lighted, they are not. The voicemail light is not lighted. Uh, it is actually just a clear button. Not sure why that is. Uh, but then we do have the LED. If I light that up. And we'll hang up. Let's try light that. Test. And we'll hang up. And there we got the the uh, voicemail light. Looks like it's a solid light. Not sure if that's configurable, but you'll notice the voicemail button is not lit. But we have a couple buttons here. We have the voicemail button. We have flash, redial, and uh, volume button. And of course, the normal dial buttons there. Um, we already noted the ringer. On the back, you'll notice a Cat5 cable, and I'm not sure why it says WAN there, a little, little distracting. Could just say LAN, I'm not sure why it says WAN. And then the power cord, and of course the handset plug-in. Got the ringer on the other side, there's really nothing on the other side, and on this side. All right, so what are some of the, the, the cons? Well, as you note, there's no screen. There's no PoE. You'll need to use some kind of adapter if you need to do PoE. No, no built-in PoE. Um, there is no switch. As we noticed, it says WAN, and that is what you get. Um, one thing I noticed up here, uh, you know, they have that notch for the Cat5 cable, which if you use a normal Cat5 cable, it's not going to fit in there real nice. So over there. Um, there is no transfer button. At first I thought this would be the transfer button and I'm guessing you could reconfigure it but by default it's just a missed call or redial button. Sorry. Um, the, the volume button here at first you might think it's a rocker. It's really just a single button that goes louder, louder, louder and then once it gets to the loudest it goes back to quiet and goes up again. So it's, a, it's not a rocker. It's actually just one button. And uh, there's no no speaker phone. Uh, this phone is meant to pick up the handset and use it. No speaker phone. There's one LED. It lets you know. It blinks if it's ringing, and it's solid if you have a voicemail. 
So that's pretty much the, the, the phone. Um, as far as the basic features, it does work. Um, has nice audio, I mean, nice call quality. Looks, you know, solid. Um, for a really basic, if cheap is the name of the game for you, then this phone might be for you. Um, make sure you know its limitations. Um, really cheap is the number one goal of this phone. So, the Spa 301.